Here's some more lava. Anything spicy over here? Man, this is the, the these areas are super risky. Cause if one arrow shoots you from a skeleton, you're basically done. But I want to find a more expansive cave network around here, dude. It's just not giving you a good look, you know? You're just not seeing what is on the other side here. You kind of have to go stealthily around. Like this. Kind of pave your way. I mean, this looks expansive. It kind of... I can't... I can't tell. Nothing interesting down that way at all. Well, that's interesting. That's a big cave. This could be bad. Okay, so I'm gonna go over here instead. I hear water flowing, which is good. But clearly this cave system goes over here as well. It has to, right? It has to. Over toward here, for sure. There, oh, there we go. Something just super died right there. I don't know what just died. This is bad. Well, this is cool, but it's bad. But it is cool. So hold on. I'm going to go back here. Recompose myself. What do I have? Nothing for wood to light up the way. Uh, okay. So. Uh. I have redstone torches. I can make sticks out of that? Oh, not many. Wow. Thanks. Okay. Awesome. All right. Uh, well. I don't know how to go about doing this. I don't know what to do. This is bad. This is totally bad. Look at this. Look at this. By the way, if you if you reflect these, you can eventually hit the skeleton if you do that. Yup, that's bad. Okay. If anything, I can lead him toward me. But even then, it's not good. But if a creeper lands in here, I'm dead. I don't know what to do. Oh, geez. There we go. That's it. That's it. There we go. All right. Grab that instead. Okay. Uh... I don't see anything of value. I really don't. Really? This is kind of incredible. Look at this cave. It's beautiful. It's definitely super beautiful, but, uh... Yeah, nothing, uh, nothing that speaks to me right now. Nothing immediately. So... Hold on. Let's reconvene. I need to... Make something. What can I make that I need? I need feet. Feet. There we go. Equip the feet. Cover those feet. I need to make pants. Can I make pants? That's a bad use of diamond for sure. Absolutely a bad use of diamond. Do not want to do that. Okay. So, through this cave, it may be smart to find a way out. Oh, you know what I can do? I can grow this. No, I lost the dirt. Oh, no. Okay. I have the saplings. I don't have the dirt anymore. Which is great. Awesome. All right. So. Well, oh, Enderman too. Awesome. Maybe the play is to go over here. Basically, I'm leaving everything behind over there. For the sake of a better life this way. Perhaps. Perhaps. I need to keep moving no matter what. I need to keep moving. Because I can't stay in one place. I don't have any wood for torches. This would have been a great little alcove to camp out in for a hot second, but it's just not. It's just not. 
Yeah, no, can't do it. Cannot do it. That would have been great. Oh, well. Yeah, no. Okay. The play may be to get out of here. It, I'm not seeing any diamonds or anything. I mean, I love the, the generated structure. The way that this is all generated is super cool. But it is just not for me. Nope. Come on. There we go. There we go. Nice. This is super risky, by the way. This is super, super dangerous. Basically, if an Enderman gets me, I'm dead. I'm super dead. I need to go up. I need to get out of here. Big time. Nope. Nope. I need to just go. Go. Gadget. Flow. Go, 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 go. Gadget. Flow. I got my go, 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 go. Gadget. Flow. I'm back. I'm back. I'm cool. I'm cool. Oh, that's daylight. Daylight? It looks close. Keep going. Keep going. That looks close to daylight. Where is this light coming from? It's coming from somewhere. That's for sure. Bread. Gotta get that bread. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get that. Boom, boom, boom. I got that bread, bread, bread. Gotta get that. Gotta get that, 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 that bread. Boom, boom, boom. Gotta get bread. Boom, boom, boom. All right. I don't know why I'm singing Black Eyed Peas right now. That's not relevant even a little bit. Um, okay. This totally seems like daylight. Like, it's, it's obviously lighter up here. I'm not hallucinating, right? It totally, it's apps. Oh, it's app. Seems like a weird structure. All right. I'm getting out of here. I'm absolutely leaving. I don't need to be here. There's not a chance. Not relevant to me at all. I am at nine. So daylight is upon us soon. Or it should be at least. Somewhere. Maybe. Come on. I got I gotta break daylight eventually. It's gotta happen. The skybox does not go that high. I mean it goes high, but not that high. I'm gonna block this out. I don't need to go back down there. That's not relevant to me anymore. I can just keep going this way. And then I can find my house again. Because technically I haven't traveled actually that far at all. So that's good. Okay, so you know you're getting to a better place when you can see the stone. I mean, you can't really see it here because it's super dark, but it turned from deep slate to cobblestone. And stone and diorite and all that, that's when you know you're making progress. And then there's dirt. And then from the dirt, sand. Oh, man. That could have been bad. That could have been bad. Water is fine. Let's go. Rising from the water. And see? It's not too far. It's fine. I don't know where I am, but I'm sure it's fine. So before, I saw that there was a ruined portal somewhere along the way that I would like to find again. And maybe I can get a better perspective from being up top high. It is currently day four. Day four. It went from day whatever it was, day two to day three. And the days are passing by, just like in life. You think you have it all timed out accordingly, and then bam, the days just flash on by. That's why you got to live in the moment as much as you can. You know what I mean? That's how, that's how it be. That's how it do. So let me find this town that was here previously and reestablish myself. Okay, so I have no idea where I am. Can't find that town. It's awesome. So the, the thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a portal, I guess, to, to somewhere. So I got to get out of here. I got I to gotta figure something out. So I definitely do not need to have all this deep slate and all this whatever around me. So now that I have all this, nothing's going to damage me or nothing should damage me while I'm out here. So we'll do this. I don't need to remember to do all that stuff. Like craft all the sticks and do do whatever. I don't I don't need to do all that. But I can make a couple furnaces out of this, which is great. So these two, bam, bam. Right here. Alright. Um, I have nothing to burn except these. Nope. Cannot burn those. Nope. I need to burn these. There we go. This 
to this, or half rather, into here. So, yeah, I got I gotta find a snowy biome and set up town before day 10. So it's gonna take me a minute to make all these things. I can't obviously burn a stone axe, that wouldn't make any sense at all, so I gotta chop down more of this stuff. Uh, but yeah, that's essentially what I'm gonna do. Hopefully you've been enjoying my shenanigans so far. Snowy biome is up next. I'll find myself a home and build a Christmas tree. So until next time, bye. It's now getting to be nighttime. Awesome. I need to find a new location for me to be at. I'm just going to keep running and running off into the night, off into the sunset, till I find my way home, wherever home is. That's a bad time. That's a bad time. Gonna go this way? That is a very exceptionally bad time. In this context of hardcore, in the context of uh, me being bad at this game, technically speaking. So I'm gonna avoid all of that conflict and be a coward, basically. And that's fine. I was just about to say, there's a fun fact that the ocean is actually one of the least explored areas of the world. Out of all the things that remain unexplored, we go far beyond our cosmos into, you know, Mars and all the planets and solar systems beyond that. But we have yet to discover all the things that are in the ocean and really all the things that our minds are able to do as well. When you think about how remarkable it is that we have thoughts and, you know, discuss ideas and this just, I don't know, it's just food for thought. Like all those creepy crawlies that are in the ocean, the way that we behave as people, it's just weird. And then now we're going all the way up into the stars and we're going to be on Mars eventually. That's pretty cool, you know, but the ocean remains incredibly unexplored. We don't know what's down there. You just keep swimming across the vast nothing, never knowing what's going to happen next. Another bad time? I've encountered two ocean monuments, but no land. How is this even possible? It's ridiculous. Like, these things are a massive pain on any other given day, especially now. I'm just going to keep swimming. Into the unknown. Into the unknown into the unknown so I think I found land I also found a coral reef which is cool remember in 101 things to do in Minecraft and I tried so hard to make like that cove oh my what the ever loving is happening here what a weird that's a weird wow that's very stark um I, I tried to make like a cove with all the different types of fish and it just didn't work because the fish AI is so awful that they keep running into walls and they don't know what's what's good for them. And it didn't really work out all that well. But hey, the coral reef looks really cool. Fish? Fish? There they are. Okay, I was gonna say, where's all the fish? The actual coral reef doesn't have any fish in it. Not the fake ones here, come on. I found it though, that's cool. Now, land is back on the menu, everybody. We got rabbits. We got fifth rabbit season. Anyone know a cartoon that's from? You probably don't. It's ancient, but it's a classic nonetheless. It's uh, Looney Tunes. There's a character that says that specific phrase. Uh, you wonder. I, I'm not gonna tell you who that one is. You're gonna have to figure that one out for yourself. It's rabbit season. Ooh, an outpost over here, which means there's a village nearby. I dare not go to an outpost right now. That is a death sentence. I am not equipped at all. But I am interested in that village nearby. Actually, in Java Edition, that doesn't necessarily mean... Ooh, that looks spicy. In Java, it doesn't necessarily mean there's an outpost. I forgot about that. It's actually super rare, I think. Because in, in the Bob SMP, there is, there is a structure like that but no village near it, actually, for quite a distance. So there might not be a village. It's a lot rarer than you think, which leads you to be like, hey, why is there a random outpost near a coral reef? You have no idea. 
If I try to go near here, well, actually, no, I'm not even going to try it. Nope. Not even going to vibe with it. Just going to keep moving. I traveled all this way to avoid a jungle biome again, and I found another jungle biome. So that's where I'm going to settle. As much as I am, have always been encouraged to never settle in life, this is where I'm going to settle. And what is going on here, everybody? That's a lot. So that looks like a decent little place right here. I mean, to be fair, I can make a jungle Christmas tree. That sounds kind of eventful. So I'll, I'll park myself right, like, around here. That seems to make a lot of sense. Yeah, I could I could cut or make a tree out of this. Got some bamboo near me, some some cliffs, lots of bamboo, like a, an exorbitant amount of bamboo. I like this. I'm gonna I'm gonna roll with it. All right. So the jungle saplings, in order to get the the massive jungle saplings, you have to do four of them together to make one giant tall tree. So that's gonna be what I do. And I'm surprised I actually haven't cut down any other jungle wood until this point here. That's a little surprising. I thought I had done something like that uh, at some point, but it turns out I didn't. So that's cool. So although it's not going to snow in the jungle temple or jungle tree, whatever you want to call it, the jungle Christmas tree, I guess, it's not going to snow around here, but it's still going to be cool regardless. And it's definitely going to be unique. So that'll be what I do. And besides, my entire 101 things to do in Minecraft was in a snowy biome anyways. And as much as I loved the snow, it did get to be quite annoying after a while, especially when I had all the ideas that I had for, like, different types of buildings to do. So having no snow for a while might be a little bit of a good thing. And I'm actually starting to feel that now that I'm older, too. Like, I love the snow in concept, but I can definitely feel it in my bones. My bones are like, hey, it's cold. You don't like this. Your body, you, you don't like this. Don't do this. Even though my mind is like, yes. My body's telling me no. My mind's telling me no, but my body is telling me yes, is basically what it boils down to. So I'm going to go for a more vertical-oriented structure to start what I mean by that is I need to do something different. So one, two, three, we're going to go one, wait, nope, one, two, three, one, two, three. I definitely don't mean to flick the shield a bunch of times. That would totally not be helpful. Um, Let's see, one, two, three. I'm going to make it a little bit weird like this, all right? So how many is this? One, two, three, four, make it five, all right? So maybe this can be the outlining of the structure. Maybe. One, two, three, four, five. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two, one. One, two, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, three, two, one. Okay. There's three, four, five. There we go. So what if the tree was this tall? Or this wide, rather? And it went all the way up. It just, just like that. And then all the leaves, all the, like it, it would still be formatted like a jungle tree. So there's different like segments. It, and it wouldn't be like a Christmas tree. You know how difficult it was to make that Christmas tree look? It wouldn't be quite like that. It'd be like this. And it, it would look like this. I kind of like that idea. So we're going to go like that over toward here. Going to make everything out of... I don't know what that sounded like, but it sounded like something. I got to cover myself around here as well. Uh, what else do I need to do right now? I need to make an, a, not an axe, a shovel. Yes, shovel. And then also a not, I'm not going to use the Acacia right now. Now nah. I'm going to go with this, going to make the double chest, the double double. So that way I can save all the stuff. Vundaba. All right. All the valuables go inside of here. Gotta love all that. All right. And then before I get out of here real quick, get rid of all this. All this stuff is so slow by comparison of how it was in the Bob SMP, man. It is like night and day. All right. So there's my there's my entrance over here. One, two, bada boom. This is where it's going to be. Going to make some doors. Give me a door. That's a shield. Totally absolute wrong thing. Here we go. There's a door. Bada bang. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. All right. So now to secure myself, I'm going to make this one more taller. 
All right, so the whole lining of the tree is gonna be like this. And then if I'm really smart, I'm gonna have a different type of material on the very outside. So that way, this can be like the inner lining. Like it's basically like having an actual house, you know, or except if you have a brick house, I guess. But when you have a house, you typically have, you know, two different types of um, structure to work with. So like on the outside, there's shingles and concrete and whatever else and wood. But then the inside, there's plaster. It's basically the same sort of idea around toward here. Uh, I'm also going to get some natural light in here by having this. Yes, there we go. So if I get rid of these, and that way, I have the beginnings of a house. And it's not an awful looking house. It actually looks half decent right now. Look at that, see? So if I take all... Oh, wait, do I have any cobblestone? I definitely don't. Look at that, see? I don't have everything prepared. I don't know what I'm talking about. If I take all this, I can make some glass. Look. I haven't dug up sand in the entire three hours I've been playing. You gotta love that one, right? Hey, wonderful. All right. So let's head back to the main base here. Yeah, see, if the tree is like that tall, it's gonna be sweet. It's gonna be good looking. All right. Oh, basement. I can make a little basement right down here and hopefully, yes, immediately find some of this stuff here. Give me all of this. So yeah, I'm gonna smelt everything down. There's gonna be a little bit of a basement here. That's not gonna be for anything super spectacular or amazing. And then after I craft a couple of tools and melt everything down accordingly, uh, a goal of mine will be to go to the nether just for the sake of it, but it's not going to be the focal point of, a, of the playthrough in really any other capacity at all. So for now, I'm going to dig all the way up here. I'm going to replace the floor with cobble, actually. And we don't, we, I always do a basement, you know, you, we don't, you, no basement. Forget about it. Whatever. Don't need it. Unnecessary. Just going to make this a nice cobble situation here. Make the walls as they should and meow it out. So hopefully you've been enjoying this playthrough so far. It is about to be nighttime again, which is incredible. Have to work through the night, obviously, because this is a hardcore survival Minecraft situation. My name has been Brian Saviano. Bricks O'Brien. Hopefully you continue to do as well as you possibly can. And I will see you for more of the 10 days of survival, however many days this is really, it could be a, a century, I don't really know. Uh, jungle planks, that's fine. And then jungle planks, that's fine. I'll catch y'all later, all right? Bye. Actually, before I get out of here, I think this looks pretty spiffy. You know, a little pattern like that. So there could be something going all the way through the top so natural sunlight can get in. And it's raining now. So I'm not gonna play off camera or anything. Right now it is day five. So it's, it's halfway there. I mean, I got a lot of resources, so that's good. So I got to get constructing this tree soon, but I'm going to log out and get on out of here. Everything freezes when I do the save menu. So I'll talk to you next time. Bye.